There we did it. That was it. 396 cars sold this year on Monday and Wednesday we sold two. Thursday it rained, so we didn't sell anything, unfortunately. Uh, people want to check their cars out when it's not raining. Unbelievable. <laughs> we sold three, making us 401 for the year. Everybody that came out to us throughout the year, that is awesome. We still have a boatload of days left in the month that we're going to be open to. And we got the 299 car in. It is not yet for sale. Uh, get it cleaned and everything like that. But the be on the lookout because it is going to go fast. So we have the 299 car. We might even have something else. I'm going to have to, I'm, I'm trying to work something else out too, where we might be able to get something else for y'all as well. Really cheap like that. Um, before the end of the year. Um, so we're, we're gonna hopefully get that done for you guys, uh, maybe sometime around uh, before Christmas or something like that. I'm still trying to work the details out on that. Um, hopefully, I'm not gonna tell you what it is because I don't wanna make a promise and then go back on my word. Um, but uh, that is coming very soon, guys. So uh, the keep on the lookout. Uh, we will post it on the Facebook page, the $299 car. Um, and as soon as it's available, first come, first serve, whoever gets it, gets it. Um, but it arrived and uh, we've got to get it cleaned and everything like that. And uh, from that point, uh, we will post it randomly. And once it's posted, it is available for sale. Um, it is not available before then or anything like that. So, and we are not going to tell you which vehicle on the lot that it is because that would not be fair either. So um, either way, um, that is it guys. So uh, we wanted to uh, say thanks to everybody that uh, bought a car. I would say all 401 people, but since a lot of people bought multiple cars, which I think, shout out to Ray and Terrace. Uh, I will not give out their last names, um, but I believe they're tied for the most vehicles bought from us because they have a, uh, I don't know, I think <laughs> I think one of them buys them and resells them. And <laughs> I think the other one, uh, the other one actually, uh, he buys them for uh, friends of his and everything that he knows. Uh, and I think they both are at six cars a piece um, that they've bought somewhere in that range. I don't think they have the exact numbers, but those two are basically, uh, have purchased the most cars from us. Um, this year so I would say that it's all it, it's not 401 individual people there are people that have bought multiple cars from us uh, for family members or stuff like that um, and, and so that's kind of the uh, the the awesome big news we got the 299 it's gonna be coming out I will be posting it at some point randomly this month um, but it is coming very soon now and then uh, just saying that we got over the 400 cars sold 401 this year uh, and there's still a lot more days left in December so come on out get yourself into a car and uh, and, and get you guys uh, taken care of get yourself driving around and everything stop taking the bus the bike all that come in get yourself a car and hey even if you have a car right now just get another one why not I mean why who doesn't want two to three four or five cars I mean just that uh, just just buy more <laughs> this is terrible life advice if you have a car you probably don't need one but if you do need one definitely stop in definitely stop in so um so yeah so we have that going on and then uh i feel like there was something else i was gonna tell you guys too um damn it what was it oh uh oh the dodge charger um actually so that uh, i wanted to mention to you guys as well uh we have a customer that um we had let them know they were eligible for an upgrade a little while ago and that if we ever got a car in to let us know which one they wanted and they would be upgraded to that part of our zero down upgrade program and we they saw the charger posted they private messaged us they came in and got it and they will be uh well they came in and took it for a test drive and they will be getting it on saturday so that will be their car that is why we have not posted it for sale or told you anything about it because uh they got dibs on it being their customer of ours uh available for an upgrade and they get priority so just shows you if you make your payments you make them on time we will let you know when you're available for an upgrade and any car you see that comes in that you want, you get zero down um, and just you just keep making your payment just the way you were before. So you don't have to put any, any money down or anything like that. And um, so that should be taken care of on Saturday. I believe they're coming out, is today Friday? Yeah, today's Friday. Shit, I'm getting all mixed up. Um, yeah, so they will be coming out on Saturday to get that. But um, 
that is uh, that is super exciting for them. So they they actually get that Dodge Charger. So if you're making your payments, uh, there are a few other people we're going to be uh, messaging pretty soon that they are available for their upgrade as well. Um, and uh, we're getting the list. We're gonna give them a call, let them know as well that hey, whenever you want, or I mean, you don't have to, but if you want, if you see a car that we get in that you want, you give us a call, you message us, you get priority, and uh, you get the car um, before we list it for sale or anything like that. Uh, because we take care of our customers, uh, we take care of the customers that are that are good for us, good to us, and and we return the favor to them as well. Because when you make your payments and you make them on time, you make our lives so much easier. Because we are a car dealership, not a daycare. So babysitting is a real pain in the ass. <laughs> it really is. Um, the <laughs> the funny thing, I, I actually have to tell the story. Uh, so it was raining on Thursday. We did. Hey, Teresa. How did you like the uh, the referral bonus you got today? I think you got two of them, didn't you? You brought in two of the customers. So Teresa made some money today. Um, and so this is a funny story. Somebody calling me. There we go. Okay. Um, I'm going to tell it anyways. Uh, Thursday, we almost sold another car, but we refused to sell it to this person. Um, <laughs> it's a pretty funny story from what I hear. Uh, basically, what happened was uh, the person tried to come in and put the down payment on three different EBT cards. Now, this is the shit you can't make up, right? I'll tell you, there's two stories from Thursday when it was raining. So we didn't have any car sales, but we got some stories. Y'all want to hear some stories. I'll tell you some stories real quick. Had a lady come in. Uh, seemed like she might have been on uh, under the influence of something. So we did not sell her a vehicle. Um, she tried to put the down payment on three EBT cards. And then we wouldn't accept them. So tried to sell drugs to the person in the parking lot. Uh, to get cash to put down on the down payment of the cars. So that's sometimes the shit you deal with uh, when you're there. Also, fun story, I really, really hope it happens because it would be awesome. I don't know if anybody got to see the uh, the sign we put out front. Uh, yellow sign, red letter, said something like free BJ. Um, and uh, yeah, we, that was a 100% legitimate sign. Um, and so if you stopped in and you got yours, uh, that is awesome, good for you. Um, but I will say we got a phone call from somebody who said that they were going to blast us all over the news, which we really hope they do because that would be so awesome. Um, but they said they were gonna blast us because they said we're the reason Aurora is so scummy and shitty. And I'm thinking, Dude, we only been there for like a year, maybe. This shit was all fucked up before we got there. I was like, if anything, it was your generation that messed it up. But we actually thought it was pretty funny. Guy calls us yelling and complaining because he was offended by the sign. I don't know. Maybe he should have stopped in and got a free BJ. He would have maybe a lot happier mood the rest of the day. But... You know, that's neither here nor there. So uh, he did <laughs> he did call us and tell us he was gonna put us all the news news because we put that sign out front. Uh, I'm under the impression that sign is still out front and should still be out front um, while supplies last. So stop in if you had not gotten it uh, or mentioned it to anybody and Daniel will take care of you. Um, and <laughs> otherwise, um, I hope you guys, uh, those are just a couple stories from uh, the rainy Thursday that we had. Um, but we wanted to thank everybody uh, once again. We had an awesome year this year. It is still not over. We have a lot more things coming next year, a lot bigger things. We're hoping to hit 500 cars next year, maybe six, who knows. It's crazy. But, uh, but yeah, so, uh, but anyways, guys, hope you guys enjoyed those little crazy stories. Um, I am about to be home and, uh, I am going to go inside and get some dinner. But with that, I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day, wonderful rest of your week, weekend, if that's starting up for you now. Um, and if you don't tune back in to see me, hopefully you have a wonderful holiday. Happy new year coming up. This is Friday the 13th. So maybe watch a scary movie tonight if you're into that thing. Uh, maybe watch The Nightmare Before Christmas. I think we put a meme up there. I don't really like that movie, but that's actually a pretty funny meme we threw up on the website. Uh, that was compliments of uh, 
of not myself. It was, I believe, my wife or somebody put that up there. Also, too, Mikey did a really funny one about the dealership. And if anybody wants to make a little custom Any Budget Cars memes, if it's funny or if it's good or whatever, we'll post it on the side because we don't we don't care. We do whatever we want. We're, it's like the wild, wild west of car dealerships. We just do whatever. We do what everybody else isn't doing and what they're afraid to do because we know we have the best deal in town so we can do whatever we want and that's just the way we like it. So uh, so with that, guys, I hope you all have a wonderful, wonderful rest of your day, wonderful Friday, wonderful weekend, and uh, we appreciate it. Uh, if you're watching the video, don't forget to like it because that, uh, that also helps us out. It makes people uh, think that it's, I'm actually saying decent stuff on here um, and then they tune in and they're like ah what a scam but <laughs> either way uh, I appreciate it guys and uh, once again we're Eddie Budget Cars 2241 Aurora Road Melbourne Florida 32935 and our number is 321-425-6313 I am out of here you guys have a wonderful night